Good evening. Thanks for joining us. I'm Beth Farnsworth. News Channel 3 Senator de Los Santos joins us live at Transmission Brewing in Ventura. And Senator, this is big news for local businesses, especially wineries and breweries. Yeah, that's right, Beth. What that means is that breweries and wineries that do not serve food can allow customers back inside for the first time in over a year. Ventura County celebrates entering the less restrictive orange tier of the state's reopening plan. The move means wineries and breweries can open indoors without food service. From this vessel into that one. Carrie Jonker owns Transmission Brewing in Ventura. The brewery opened just before COVID hit. We opened in January of, of last year and, you know, had a good two and a half months before the first shutdown. Transmission Brewing is connected to Topper's Pizza, which allowed Jonker to keep his business open. But others that didn't serve food had to figure out a way to stay open during the pandemic. It used to be if, if it was a brewery tap room, you could survive on the beer and and, you know, food trucks weren't always as reliable. And I think this pushed a lot of places towards really nailing down their food options and, and creating a more restaurant type offering. Breweries and wineries can open indoors at 25% capacity or 100 people, whichever is fewer. That means more customers and more revenue. One symbolic thing is during that first shutdown, we put a bunch of chairs on, you know, above our rafters and, and put those up there for storage. And we're, for the first time since, since the first shutdown, we're, we're taking those back down and those are landing in our dining room. As the state hopes to fully reopen on June 15th, Junker is excited to see his brewery full as he envisioned it. The sentiment of people changes when we go to these next tiers and people start feeling more comfortable and, and they're more ready to go out and, and socialize or, or go out with their family. And I'm excited to see people out and happy to be out. And while today is only day one of the orange tier for Ventura County, county leaders say that the least restrictive yellow tier is not that far away. In Ventura, Senator De Los Santos, News Channel 3. More hope on the horizon. Thanks, Senator Ventura County.